so the students uh, had the opportunity to learn how to make uh, grow lettuce from seeds to plate. We always talked about growing food on campus and this is the, the, the first time that like a, a classroom or a grade like actually does it. And yeah, we're super happy to, to see the, the students come and deliver their lettuce every other week and love the, the taste of it and the look of it. And yeah, it's like a dream for, for like a chef to, to have like fresh produce. How do you go from seed to plate? Let's look to the expert to find out. Exploring gardens. We were looking for a place that was a, like a real safe spot for plants to grow. We tried the sweet potato farm, but that didn't work because it wasn't protected from insects or bad weather. We tried the kindergarten, it was protected from bad insects, but it wasn't protected from bad weather. We tried the rooftop garden, wasn't protected from insects, insects, and it really wasn't protected from bad weather. Then finally, we tried the high school grow tower. So the high school grow tower was the safest and best part to grow lettuce. So that's why we use, we got the example from that. Gathering information. We, we went to first grade and we got mixed up with partners at first grade. We, we went to all the different lettuces and see which one we liked the most. I think this is the most one that people like. Planting! We first got the rock wall and we put it, and then we put it on the tray and then we put it seeds into it. And as time grew by, I, the seeds grew and grew. And after it's done, we'll take them to the nursery. And then after the nursery, they went to the first grade. Building the Grow Tower. I started with the bottom bit. I was the first group to like start building it, and then we stacked up the thing. And then the lights came down. And then the, the other groups like put the lettuce in and the black cups. The how we have this lettuce growing is that the big thing down there is like a tank we put the water in and then there's like this straw that goes all the way up to the top and then it rains down so all the lettuce can get some water. What was really cool about the hydroponics? That we don't have to do anything, we can just just let it stay for a week. It's because um, it will water it for you, and it also has lights to give it plenty of sunlight. So you don't really have to take care of them yourself. The thing takes care of itself. Growing, harvesting, tasting. Every day when we come to the class, we look at our plants, if it's good or not. We named the lettuce and, and we did lots of science with it. We also measured how um, big it's growing. When it was ready, I like knew because the lettuce was like puffy and like big. And after, when it's good, when Mr. Hardy said it, that it's okay, then we harvested them. Everybody got to harvest their own plant, and then we put it in these trays. Then what we would do is um, put it on plates, and then we'd taste test it. Lettuce delivery. And then like we'd carry it to the cafeteria and then Chef David would try it and he would tell us if it's good to put in the salad bar or not. We bring it to the cafeteria because it's because everyone would get like a, like a mountain full of lettuce. So they were running out of lettuce. So like the young the two youngest grade of the whole school are the first one to do this project, which like is the most possibly the most sustainable thing to do like in a concrete way for, for that can impact 
them directly and people around them. To be uh, such a young age to understand that you can actually make a change, is, it's, um, it has real value, I think, to, to the whole school. I'm always amazed by the delivery that we get from the kids. And we've noticed that more elementary and kindergartens are eating salad. How did, how did you feel when you gave it to Chef David? I'm proud. I was proud because I grew the lettuce. When I got to see my plants, I felt that I was happy and a little bit excited. How did it feel to you to see the lettuce in the cafeteria? Um, I just felt, I just felt, hello, Bob. Well, my lettuce was named Bob. <laughs> I felt uh, uh, happy because we could fit, feed the whole elementary school. The whole life side, yeah, actually. Even, even us, we can feed ourselves.